It's Thursday, December 20th, 2012. I'm Ross Miller, and this is 90 Seconds on the Verge of the End of Time as we know it. The European Commission will charge Samsung, quote, very soon for its use of injunctions against Apple in Europe. The Commission has been investigating Samsung for a possible breach of antitrust rules since January. There's a good chance Samsung has already seen these charges in private, as it has already dropped those injunction charges against Apple this week. And if you didn't have enough reason to despise Facebook this week, along comes a new method for random strangers to pay Facebook to message you. Facebook is testing the feature with a very small portion of American users. Those people can pay good money for their messages to hit someone else's inbox, even without mutual friends. No word yet on how much you can pay Facebook to not let this happen to you under any circumstances. Finally, with the rise of drone surveillance comes the logistical hurdle of watching and analyzing staggering amounts of footage. QESPN. According to reports from USA Today, the US Air Force is working with the Sports Network and other video analysis experts to find new ways of managing the video. In 2001, the Air Force received about 4,800 hours of drone footage. Last year, that number jumped to over 327,000 hours. The Air Force hopes it can find a software solution, but until then, it will continue to rely on sheer manpower. For obvious reasons, crowdsourcing is not an option. That's it for today's top stories. Tune in tomorrow, tomorrow 